Hi, boys and girls. It's Tuesday, May 5th. It's Mrs. J, your beautiful queen. Today, we're going to continue to read informational texts and work on main idea and key details. And parents, if you get on the insignia page, there's a great Brain Pop Junior video on main idea. You just type in main idea and you'll see that main idea video pop up and click on that. And those in instructions should be on your Class Dojo page. Now, boys and girls, main idea is what the point the author wants you to understand. What is that story mostly about? And usually you can find the main idea in the title or in the first paragraph. Today, we're gonna to reread how to make ice cream. And here to help us out is gonna be my daughter, Mallory. Hello. Just waiting for it to open up. All right, here we go. Okay. This is How to Make Ice Cream by Tom Green. A cold treat can't be beat. When the summer sun shines down, kids everywhere want a special treat. Not just any treat, they want ice cream. Ice cream comes in many flavors, even some weird ones like pipple, pickle and pepper. Did you know that you don't need to buy ice cream from the store? You can make this sweet treat yourself. Ice cream is so good it has its very own day. The third Sunday in July is National Ice Cream Day in the United States. More than just ice and cream. As much fun as it is to eat ice cream, there's a different kind of fun that comes from making your own. When you combine the ingredients and use some simple science, ice cream is the delicious result. Vanilla is the world's most popular ice cream flavor. Though some people use ice cream makers to prepare ice cream at home, most people do not have one of those machines. Do not worry, ice cream is easy to make without one. First, gather all the ingredients and supplies. You will need sugar, whole milk, heavy cream, ice, a teaspoon, salt, a gallon size sealable plastic bag, and a quart size sealable plastic bag, large bowl and measuring cups, and vanilla extract. Cool cooking. Pour three quarters cup of heavy cream and a quarter cup of milk into a measuring bowl. Don't be afraid to change the recipe a bit. Add other ingredients such as chocolate syrup and berries to change the flavor. Next, add three teaspoons of sugar and half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Pour the mixture of milk, cream, sugar, and vanilla into the smaller plastic bag. Then gently squeeze the air out of the bag and seal it. Take the larger plastic bag and fill it about halfway with ice cubes. Crushed ice works even better. Once there's ice in the bag, add six or eight teaspoons of salt to the ice. Table salt will work fine, but rock salt is better. Salt helps transfer the cold from the ice to the creamy mixture inside the smaller sealed bag. This helps your mixture turn into ice cream. Next, place the smaller sealed bag of cream, milk, sugar, and vanilla into the larger bag of ice and salt. Gently squeeze extra air from the large bag and seal it. Take the large bag with ice, salt, and a smaller and smaller bag of creamy mixture inside and shake it good and hard for 10 minutes. Wear a pair of gloves to keep your hands from getting too cold and share the job with a partner. When your arms get tired, your partner can take over. Just keep shaking the bag. After at least 10 minutes of heavy duty shaking, pull out the small sealed bag. Quickly rinse the salt off under cold water so none of it accidentally gets into your ice cream. Worth the work. After all your hard work, it's time to dig in. Dish out a big scoop of ice cream and give it a taste. In less than half an hour, you've made yourself tasty ice cream right at home. Add sprinkles, chocolate sauce, or some raspberry if you like. Toppings add fun and flavor to your treat. Ice cream makes people smile, it tastes good, and it's cold creaminess feels good on a hot day. With a few ingredients, a little patience, and a bit of work, anyone can make their own ice cream. It really is the icy treat that can't be beat. Thanks, Mally. Now we're at the glossary. And boys and girls, don't forget the glossary gives us the definitions of words we find in our text that are in bold print. And this story also has the index. And there's even some cool websites to visit with your parents' permission.
Okay, now boys and girls, we're gonna go over the main idea. So the main idea of this story is how to make ice cream. And guess what? It was right there in the title. The main idea and key details. Now remember, the details are specific things related to the main idea. Oh, I forgot to pop back on. So the key details, you could find a bunch of different ones in that story. The ones I put down are you need several ingredients to make ice cream and you need to shake the bag for 10 minutes. Make sure you wear gloves so your hands don't get too cold. And boys and girls, don't forget to put your key details in complete sentences. All right, then there's a little quiz. According to the text, which is the correct order to make ice cream? And our choices didn't pop up. All right, now boys and girls, you have to show us what you know. You are going to read how to make lemonade and complete the rest of the Nearpod. And don't forget, here's your information to log in. And then you're gonna go ahead and finish reading how to make lemonade. And then you're gonna take some quizzes. And then you're gonna do a little compound words. And remember, that's just two words put together to make one new word. All right, boys and girls, get to work and make sure you share with your teachers everything that you're doing.